I'm eating thousands of calories worth of Burger King and McDonald's in this week's food challenge. The Whopper versus the Big Mac. The McNugget versus the Chicken Fry. The rivalry between Burger King and McDonald's has gone on for decades. But in this food challenge, I'll be crowning a winner between the two. This is the clash of the calories. McDonald's versus Burger King. Hi, can I help you? Hi there, I'd like one Whopper, please. Is that gonna be enough for one person? Ha! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Thanks so much, have a good day. Now, it's time to head to the next destination, McDonald's. Hi there, I'd like two Big Macs, please. All right, thank you so much. It's gonna be a great post-workout meal. Thanks so much, have a good day, all right? Thank you. Thank you. All right, everybody, we have our McDonald's, we have our Burger King. Now, it's time to get this home and get this all presentable. Wow, this is going to be absolutely delicious. I am so excited to get into all this fast food. After the last clash of the calories, I have been getting a lot of requests, but one of the most requested clash of the calories was for me to do Burger King versus McDonald's, and that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing today. If you're new to the Calorie Clash series, I take the most famous fast food places and I put them up against each other. And I'm very excited about today's video because I have McDonald's, which is a legendary fast food destination, and I have Burger King, which is also a legendary fast food destination. And before I get into today's challenge, I need to know down below right now, are you a McDonald's person or are you a Burger King person? Let me know down below in the comments. And while you're down below in the comments, Hit me with your favorite item at whatever fast food destination you are. In today's Calorie Clash, I'm gonna be breaking this up into four different rounds. Each round is gonna feature an iconic item at each fast food destination. And at the very end of each round, I'm gonna crown a winner for the round, but at the very end of the challenge, I'm gonna crown a winner between McDonald's and Burger King. Anyways, everyone, without further ado, this is the Calorie Clash. Burger King versus McDonald's. Let's do this. All right, everybody, so the first round is going to be the nugget round because McDonald's has amazing nuggets. They're famous for their chicken nuggets, but Burger King also has chicken fries, and chicken fries are amazing, so let's get into it. All right, everybody, it's time to get this challenge started in three, two, and one. That's far. All right, the first order of chicken fries is down. So far, it's tasting absolutely amazing. Chicken fries are just a classic. Now, try some ranch and some zesty sauce. Mmm, that's good. All right, everybody, well, the Burger King chicken fries are down. Absolutely amazing, but how will they compare to McDonald's chicken nuggets? We got sweet and sour sauce, tangy barbecue, and they did not put any of their ranch in. But oh well. The sweet and sour sauce is great, but what if we put some wild sauce in? Let's see how it's gonna taste. Let's see how it's gonna taste. Woo! Everyone, we got our first W. Oh, W moment. That is legendary. <clears throat> All right, everybody, well, our nuggets are down. I gotta say, Burger King, their chicken fries were amazing, absolutely legendary, but I think the winner of the nugget round, it's, got, it's gotta be McDonald's nuggets, absolutely amazing. McDonald's just, they, they brought the nugget game tonight. Now, everybody, it's time for round number two, the burger round. So this is gonna be a very controversial round because McDonald's is known for the Big Macs. Burger King is known for their Whoppers. I think I'm gonna start with Big Mac first. So that is our first Big Mac right there. Let's get into it. Hmm. All right, so now we're gonna try some sweet and sour sauce and some barbecue sauce. This is what we call exocerizing. We're gonna exocerize the style here. <clears throat> Our Big Macs are down. Now I think it's time to go after the Whopper right here. 
If you're talking about Burger King and you're talking about McDonald's, the first things that usually come to mind are their Big Macs and their Whoppers. And I feel like there are two types of people in this world. A person that loves Big Macs and a person that loves Whoppers. Let's see what we got here. Man, that's good. It's iconic. All right, so now the Whopper is down. We gotta get to the McDonald's signature burgers right here, which are their quarter pounders. So let's see what we got. Here we go. Solid. Alrighty, now we're working on over to the bacon cheeseburgers from Burger King. These have always been a favorite of mine. All right, everybody, well, second round is complete. The quarter pounders were amazing. The Big Mac was absolutely amazing as well, but I gotta give this round to McDonald's. McDonald's is it's leading the way right now. But everybody, we have two more rounds left. So now it's time to get to the next round, which is a round I'm really looking forward to. It's time for the fry round. This is gonna be another controversial round because McDonald's is also really well known for their fries. We also have our Burger King fries as well. And I just wanna say right now, from a presentation standpoint, McDonald's, what are you doing? All right, I just gotta point out the fact that these are a little, like, not full, okay? That's, that's all I'm gonna say about that, but hey, maybe they're gonna taste amazing, all right? And I'm actually gonna start with the McDonald's fries first. Before I get into these fries, though, I just gotta say, exercise, I'm all about extra fries. I just gotta say right now, I'm a little disappointed because McDonald's usually, they bring it with the salt on their fries. But tonight, they just didn't bring it. I'm gonna have to add some more salt to the already ridiculous salt fest that I have for tonight. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta doctor up your food. All right, so our McDonald's fries are down now. Heading on over to our Burger King fries right here. You know, you guys gotta comment down below. Let me know what you wanna see for the next cost of the calories. We've done Pizza Hut versus Domino's, KFC versus Popeyes. Let me know what you wanna see next. All right, everybody. Well, I gotta say, McDonald's, I'm really disappointed in the fries I had tonight from McDonald's, so I'm gonna have to give this round to Burger King. Now, everyone, it's time for the round I'm most excited about. It's time for the dessert round. For tonight's dessert round, I have Burger King's famous Hershey's Pies. These things are absolutely legendary, and I also have their Oreo shake right here, and apparently they have a chocolate Oreo shake. Never had this before. I'm very much looking forward to that. And Donald's, how can we forget their legendary apple pies? All right, these things are just absolutely amazing. Also got a McFlurry over here as well. This is an M&M McFlurry, and I got a strawberry shake. Whew. Let's get into it. Let's start with the BK stuff first. I'm actually really curious about this chocolate Oreo shake. That looks absolutely sensational. It's a tad bit melted. Oh well. Okay. Whew. That is absolutely amazing. That is gonna get a W, O, W moment. Because that is everything I need after all that salt. Wow, Burger King. Coming in clutch. This is one of my favorite things on the Burger King menu right here. Just take a moment to check that out. Always fun.
Now, there's another dessert item that Burger King typically has, and it's their Dutch apple pies. They were out of them, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Making it happen. Making it happen. I lost my life. All I can say right now is that it's going to be a very close battle between McDonald's and Burger King. Now, I think I'm going to get on over to the McDonald's pies. These things are absolutely legendary. Try this McFlurry that's all melted. That's a sad McFlurry. And I just want to say, if you've made it up into this point of the video, go ahead and comment down below, pie, because this dessert round had a lot of pies in it. And right now I'm gonna try this strawberry shake soup. Not really feeling it. You know what everybody, I think I'm just gonna call it there because both my Burger King shake and my Strawberry shake from McDonald's are literal soup right now. But regardless, still put down definitely over 10,000 calories worth of food. And I gotta say the winner of the dessert round is definitely going to be Burger King because those Hershey's pies were absolutely amazing. And it's hard because Burger King and McDonald's are neck and neck right now. But I gotta give the winner of this clash of the calories too. Burger King. Burger King is the winner tonight, everybody. Absolutely amazing, but I do wanna know down below right now what you guys prefer. Are you team Burger King or are you team McDonald's? Let me know down below in the comments. While you're down below in the comments, don't forget to hit that like button. I'm gonna go ahead and put another food challenge similar to this one right along the sidebar for you all to enjoy along with a playlist that I have with food challenges just like this one. Like I said, don't forget to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you all in the next food challenge.